Hello, and welcome to Be Open at Phoenix. We are doing our version of what is the real-life championship race, I guess, here tonight. Visiting Phoenix, though I uh, promise you it's much less important than that. I <laughs> uh, just grabbed myself the OSR setup here uh, for this Tuesday night race. Unfortunately, we have gotten into a single split. Uh, it, I think it just barely missed splitting or something, but uh, we've got ranging from me at 5100 I rating to 300 down at the bottom So green, green, green. could be an interesting race I'll Try to get okay. a run to the line here. I don't know if that was the best way to do it but uh, It's actually kind of cold On the first lap, so it might uh, be kind of difficult get a good lap. We'll see. I'm just going to be easier on the throttle than I normally would be. We'll get a banker in and then worry about One more lap. driving harder this lap, I guess. I, I don't know. I guess I don't get the run up to the line, though. That's kind of kind of hurt the lap. Maybe I should have... <laughs> Maybe I should have thought about this differently. And... Uh, use the second lap getting around to the line. I don't know, there's probably a better way I could have done this, but... Oh well. This lap will actually be better, it looks like. So we got ourselves a 27208. It's actually not so good. I know I can do much better than that. So my all-time best is a 26899. I, must, I did that last time I was here at this combo, I believe. So I know I can do better than that. I think the way to do it, if you really wanted to get a good lap, is take the first lap to get the tires up to temp, then get the run to the line to get your uh, run down here. Obviously, I didn't get the run that time. I'm kind of just driving around, but that would be the way to do it because... In my experience, pushing when you're out there on the first lap through this corner, it gets sideways way too easily. So that would probably be the smart way to go about it. I kind of just lackadaisically drove in there and I kind of just half paid attention to that qualifying run. That's probably not good. But we're okay. We're third place for now. Now see, these two guys probably did it the right way. They probably got that run to the line, had the tires up the temp, and probably uh, did everything they needed to do. Like, let's see, if I uh, get the run to the line, the tires are a little bit less fresh now, but let's see what happens if I do it like this. So, okay, run to the line, could have been a little bit better, driving pretty hard. Feel like there's a little less grip up here, but tires are still pretty good. Not very good in the final corner, I think. 27147. So that wasn't even really all that much better. Though you could probably take a little bit of time off of that, assuming that the tires would be a little grippier. But I think I probably would have ended up in, like, the same spot anyway, so. That's all good. That's all good and well. We'll stay out here and do a practice pit in. If we have time. And we should, unless everybody is ready. In which case, hooray, everybody's ready. Let's get this thing started. So I think the way to do it would be pitting in. Drive in. Shift to third. And then I break up that yellow line. Look out for the pitch that seems limit. to be pretty good. I can probably even go a little bit faster than that. Down to fourth. That's fine. I just hope we get some green laps. Let's see what I'm Not saying much anymore, I guess. But just about 12 seconds. Looks like we got handful of people that are both not here and not clicking the blue button and not qualifying and all of the above, so. 
I hope we get some good green flag running this race. All I can really ask for. I don't know if I'm going to be good at saving the tires. I'm not sure. This is a... I have obviously done this combo before, but... You know, different setup this time than last time. I'm not remembering too much about how it goes. I actually did something kind of funny. I went and looked back at my old video to remember what I was using for breaking points and stuff. So... Thank you, me, I guess? <laughs> That's just uh, that's probably just gonna perpetuate bad habits. Is all that's gonna do. But um, I'll of course, if Nick or Gavin or any number of uh, other people that also do videos decide they want to. Uh... Uh, Nicky, what's Nicky, your what's name? It? Said they want to do this race. I'll be able to watch. Nicky Bobby, Bobby don't, you don't you announce for WSDRL? I I I, I did. Yeah. 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 All right then. <laughs> so I actually, real deal is what you're saying. I put my force feedback up because the car was feeling kind of numb, but not in a bad way necessarily, like it was at Homestead. That was numb, and it felt like you just couldn't drive it at all. Here, it kind of feels like the car's driving itself. So I guess that's kind of a good thing. It feels like uh, it gets through the corners real well. I did my signature add 1% to the tape, <laughs> um, so if it blows up, that's my fault. But in practice, it seemed to be just fine, and I can always lift off if it's going to blow. But, uh, just going to try to you know, aim for solid, clean race. Top 10 wouldn't be too bad. I think I'd try to... I'd really like to get a top 5, but that seems... Like a lot to ask for. I don't want to ask for too much. So. I think we're ready to go, though. Two Chiefs ready. Zero. I'm ready. Let's get lane. rolling. One to green. We got the weird, uh. Very early potential start here. Because the uh, restart zones are not yet implemented. They're only in hosted sessions right now, I think. Second gear start looks like. About to go green. Plenty of pull doing that. You Gotta watch him just in case he decides he wants to go now. Be nice if he didn't, but kind of like not keeping a consistent pace speed. I don't think he did that on purpose though. All right, we are off. Check where he is over there. It's not going to take the dog leg on the start. Oh my god, this guy's flying up on the on my behind. I just prefer not to spin out. That'd be nice. I'm going to try to protect the tires. Just in case we do go green for any length of time. I really got sideways there. And we got a caution. Hoping we don't get too many of those, but definitely expect a number of them. Phoenix is so open-ended with how you can race it. I feel like you can get plenty of guys finding each other on the racetrack. It's fine, you got loads. We do not have loads of fuel. <laughs> That's still got to calibrate clearly. Car is out. Line up single file behind car zero two. Guess we got a lot of catching up to do. That was the lowest I rated guy in here. That was a 300, I think. So he was. Uh, he has gotten into trouble already. It would seem. Got a car field car in front of us. That's funny. Obviously, have not driven at all yet. That guy thinks he's going to trick people into pitting, I guess. How many sets we got? Three? That's... That could end up giving us something to think about. Limited enough. 
if we get some weirdly timed cautions, you might wish you had a set. Hopefully these pace laps go by pretty quick. I'm going to go ahead and save fuel just because I can. But it's probably not going to be important. Yeah. I muted them again, so I <laughs> turn that back on. Who knows if they were yelling at each other or something. Probably didn't really need to hear it anyway if they were. The twelve's passing us on the outside. Tell me it is two to go here coming up. I hope so. Let's get these things done. Let's go, go, go. Hello, can everybody hear me? Yep. Pits are open. I think I must have, I might have raced the three car last time I was here. We did here. Yeah. That seems familiar, specifically at this track too. What did he say? I might be full of nonsense. Kyle Larson. Hey, Drew. Hey, two green. Closed. Good Good night 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 night. Night. closed. Kyle, we're glad you're not careful, but they sent you to Home Depot. I think we got late night fever going on. People being weird. Or well, everybody had a good night. Yes, so we'll get formation. We'll be on the outside again, just like the race is starting for the first time. Kind of a cloudy day here in Phoenix. And a night race. Sun setting. It is Ooh. in sim. 7.12 at the moment. Should be completely dark by the time this one finishes, especially if we're going to be getting cautions. One left to green. You're on the outside this time. All right, Colton. Get ready. Race will resume at the end of this lap. So we'll see uh, if the guy goes around the same time again, or if he'll try to jump the field or anything. Get ready, going green. Post car is off. Such a long time to be going without the pace car. That guy to hold his line, please. He might have. I was just feeling like he was kind of close to me. Don't want to fight him too much right now. If he wants to get by, I'm not going to trouble him too much. He breaks much harder than I expect him to here. Don't want to go super aggressive with the uh, dog leg at this point in time. Doesn't seem necessary. This car can get un get unsettled too, so I think I'm just gonna focus on trying to keep the car happy, keep it safe, all that good stuff.
And I'll follow as well for a little bit. I don't mind. I almost wanted to take that run, not so much though. Just being patient. Wow, the three does not. He drifts up way high with the guy on his outside. That was a little scary. nerve-wracking. I got some guys catching up from behind. It's concerning me a little bit. I don't want to just fall backward. So I might have to find a way around. Let's get, we're getting a much better run out of this corner. I'm gonna have to save this corner <laughs> during this race because I can never remember what quarter's which anymore. They changed this track like 500 times. We're gonna come down here. Car outside. Pinches us pretty hard. Go low. He's gonna fight us all the way, I guess. Still there, hold your line, you keep right. That was at 27.9. Outside is clear. Alright. Cleared him. We get tight on exit just because we had to take a lower entry. Come on, man. Why are you wasting our time? Clear. Give it up. Making me have to drive harder into that corner for no reason. Just a little bit of boot came out. Your chief whining about the temps. <laughs> I'm sure they're just fine. I'll put it up though, just to keep an eye on it. At the moment, not even in the uh, caution area. It kind of turns like that. I think it turns orange first, maybe? Maybe there's a yellow beforehand. But... Kind of just letting the brakes get me rotated into this corner and then using the throttle on exit. Just using the steering wheel as little as possible. Pretty uh, pretty heavy braking zone over here. This is a place where you can really lose some uh, tire on the right front, I think, so I have to be cautious of that. I had to get on the right rear a little bit through there. Those are the thoughts anyway. Like I said, I don't remember too much how how to race here. I'm sure I'll learn a lot through this race. Single file. You don't fucking break one into the corner or what? Catch that two, car. Do we pit now? Race cars out. Line up single file. Line that was a decent cars. run there. Two. We're under caution. Pits are closed. Three sets of tires though. I didn't feel too bad. Hmm. They're all going, I'm going. Pit lane speed limit is 45 miles per hour. Pit line isn't all the way until up we'll to there. Stop, yeah. As you start to move down, I'll move down with you so you don't get turned. Pit box team, 10. 
Five, three, two, one, one. Right here. I don't think we can make it on fuel yet. Could be wrong. Oh, uh, maybe we can. Looks like we'll jump that guy. He's decided we have not jumped him and it's going to drive in front of me. Okay, thank you. <laughs> we got some people staying out. Looks like two of them. Sixth and seventh place. So we'll have to be patient making our way around them. I don't think it's going to be too bad. 95-95. I should have used the restroom before starting this race, I just realized. <laughs> Is that TMI? <laughs> Maybe it'll make me faster. Get the race over with sooner. So where's that going to put us then? Oh, we had one guy pit. One of the guys that had originally stayed out, I think. So I think we're fourth now. Yeah, so only the 19 has decided to uh, stay out completely. Should be okay, so long as everybody's patient. Like I said, I don't think he should be too far off pace, other than just maybe not being able to keep up with the front guys in general. I should be saving fuel. Why am I not thinking about that? We're close. One point nine gallons. Nice thing. Where are you at when you came into the middle position? It's our open. He, he didn't pit. Three. Yeah. yeah, I know. I was asking like where he was before when the caution came out. Trying to get a gauge on how fast he's going to be. I think. They call car 24. Inside? Maybe walk on water? Why are we on the inside? Yeah, go fuck yourself, Kyle Swag! What? Why am I. God, I love eye racing. Why am I with you? I'm about to go green. I'm What's happening? Why is he down there? What the heck? What's happening? What a terrible start. Everybody behind me, just watch out. What is this start? I really got a black flag for that. I'm about to fuck you. Car outside. Clear high. Car outside. You're the fucking idiot. Low. There was a car on the high side. That was the worst start yeah, I've ever seen. Yeah, I don't know what was going on up there, but... Oh, that, was clear. that was a disgusting mess. 19, you better hope I don't see you, because you're not going to finish this race. <laughs> it's quoting. Now, now. Uh, fight for... I get a black flag because he wants to speed up and slow down the field. On purpose! Oh, and that pull out of the apron! Yeah, it to drop down to the apron there. Ah, uh, that leader, the one that didn't pick up. Got the black flag. Yeah, that one well, that was weird. Keep started, I'm doing black. So we're stuck behind the 12 again, that's okay. Get around them. Outside. That time was outside clear. I'm a fan of outside. Stay on the outside, that guy says. I just don't understand what was going through that. 
Just remember, don't drink and drive. I just think it's absolutely ridiculous that I have to suffer to seduce an idiot. Yeah, that sucks for the two. Garfield's not laughing anymore. For Monday, I'd say he hates Mondays, but I guess he hates Tuesdays now. Wish it were Monday. The lap team. I didn't just lose a lap, I lost two laps because of it. That was a 27.4. You know, Jason, that's a very valid point. <laughs> <laughs> yep. That was so strange. I feel like I'm all out of rhythm now because, like, I don't even know what's happening anymore. But we're doing okay. We're in third place. I've kind of gotten in the habit of just taking this dog bag. Just leaving time on the table if you don't, so I'll take it whenever I feel comfortable. Order some DoorDash and watch the race. Kind of like in a wider entry into the final corner here. Allows me to, it almost feels like Nashville Super Speedway. Because it allows me to cut down, get less on the right front. And uh, I can position myself to take the dog leg easier so it's more comfortable. Kind of liking how that works, or how that feels. It still feels great. We were 95-95 before, so apparently doing okay on tires. I have to save fuel. 1.6. We'll see how much our fuel usage changes as the run goes on. I was worried I was going to be close to him there. We had plenty of room though. In the case, triple monitors would have been nice. <laughs> I mean, I've been saying that a lot lately. Maybe I'll add that to a Christmas list. That's kind of a lot. Also, my one monitor, quote unquote, I have now is a TV, so <laughs> I don't know how that works. I have to do some research into how to get that all working right, if I do want that. Oh my Jesus! What the fuck? Outside. Clear high. What the fuck, man? That's the same guy too, isn't it? He's singing us some kid rock. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Add me, add me on Discord. I dare you. I'll add you on Discord. Well, we might have gotten a little bit of damage from that. I think I didn't hit him too bad, but... I do need friends. Say hi, please. Say hi, please. Hi, You're either going to chew my asshole out or I'm going to get a free Kid Rock concert. I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to you. I'm talking to my car. I'm literally just putting me in the walker in a reason. Clear outside. We're so close to this race splitting, too. You definitely got some beat with somebody. I'm kind of afraid to do that guy. If you just saw what happened to me, I think you'd understand. Oh, 100 percent. I'll keep it. Go get him, Tiger. I could use a caution right now. Pull back on the track! Uh, yeah, I wasn't sure if you were going to wreck him into me or what, man. Are you trying to race me or are you trying to wreck him? I'm not. I'm not. I'm not going to show my displeasure. I'm out of your way. I'm up on ice. I think you're getting your coffee. 
Ridiculous how I have damage after I was leaving. Can't pit now. Race cars out. Line up single file behind car number zero seven. Driving a fuel. I was just kidding. Like, we didn't have to use the caution, yo. Full course yellow. Pits are open. Wrecking turn three. Under caution. <laughs> what a mess. Yeah, the caution. Uh oh, caution on the caution. What's the uh, lead lap? Catch the pace car. The leader, Alonso, is pit I take, you can't, you can't brake check, you can't brake check somebody right there. Uh, you, can't, you can't do that. Okay. I gotta save tires, gotta man. The back end of the field, and I'm trying to let you by the first time. You can't come up in front of me and just brake check me like that. Kyle Busham. No, he, I mean, he, I literally ran in the back of him, and he, and he's gone. Like, he literally comes up in front of me and just brake checks me. And there's nothing I can do, I can't miss him. One point. Oh, oh well, yeah, I thought that guy, he did really good, but I mean, for you, for that boy, I can't probably. hear, because these guys keep talking. How many, how much fuel do I need? 1.9 gallons. 1.9? I feel like I have enough fuel. I gotta save a set of tires though, at some point. Shit, I wanted the pit. Damn it. So we're not the only one at least. The number five is out still. I swear, all the people that have any shot are on bread. I dare you to talk to me. Pit Road is closed right Under now. Caution. Pits are closed. Cut the dog leg, save some fuel. 1.7 gallons. A little concerned about the fuel, but I feel like we should be able to make it. I'll just say it now, I'm going to be using the Geico restart zone, so we're going to have a little bit cleaner of a restart, I hope. One to go, next time by, you'll okay, be lining up on the inside. Resume at the end of this lap. I'm so frustrated, man. Every open race I do, when I feel like I have speed, I just get put in the wall and rack. That sucks. I hate to say that the part of it is the circulation all where it is. Hey, this is like... Tyler. Really fast. Green, stay focused. Well, it's green. Stay focused. The pace car is off. Be ready. It's a Reaper speed lap. Yeah. Alright, try to hold the 55. Okay, speed. I run in Reaper too. Heck yeah, man. Green flag, green flag. Not too smooth, you're running second. Alright, so that's like the first time I've used that. That's kind of neat. Okay, you are the Gonna have to get used to that, I guess. Anyway, so, hey. Why not give it a try there? Not too surprising. Well, that lot to go on. Pace 
Pace car is out. Pits are closed. Pace car is out. Line up. I don't know why I doubt it'd be okay. We're going to get a lot more of those yellow, yellow, yellow flags. Pit road's open. Full course yellow. I have no idea what you said. Yeah. Sounds like that one guy on coveralls on was in the water bowl. Yeah, for sure. Who was that that was in front of me, like right right behind the spinner? I'm <laughs> sorry, I kinda can't do that. That's why I don't I didn't want to like come back in once okay, everybody else pit too. Pretty wide there for a second trying to put myself in the back. Kind of right there too. The middle of the in front of all of That's the guy that was really well there. around us, the yeah, eleven or the thirteen or something like that. Yeah, the moment I saw him, yeah, the, start the twelve is what it was. All, I split. Got, I overshot the corner watching him. <laughs> and I was like, I'm gonna just go. To he the was wall. right up next to us, and now he was caught in a wreck. So, yeah, it's actually pretty dramatic. There, uh, I saw my life last year. Uh, he's had a dead heart. Yeah, here. Shut up. <laughs> I'm trying to hear what my crew chief's saying. Nineteen. Got the lucky dog. Let them pass on the. Of course, Nat's telling me about the lucky dog. I gotta adjust my volumes or something. Okay, we good? 1.1 gallons. 1 1.1 gallons, we can save that. <laughs> I think I'm going to be really happy I have uh, saved one of these sets of tires. It's only three, like I said, that can come into play. So I'm glad I took a look at that before the start of this. You know, after that first couple of runs, we were 95-95 on the rights. I feel like the tires aren't too bad. If we lose a couple spots... Of yellow, pits are open for a little bit, that's okay. I don't think we're gonna fall too far back though. Oh, here's the 19. The pit road is closed right now. That is glory. <laughs> He's still out here. I didn't see exactly what happened. I know his restart was absolutely horrible, but then whatever happened with him and like I think it was the Home Depot car, I didn't really get a good look at what the situation was. Maybe that wasn't his fault, but his restart was pretty poor. I will say that. The starting and stopping, you just can't do that. Zero point nine gallons. Zero point nine. We're pretty much there. Pace is gonna slow down as runs go longer too, so I think we basically are good on fuel. I'll continue saving as well though. One left to green. Line up on the inside. Race cars coming in this lap. Okay, sorry for looking over so much. Just trying to cut the course a little bit. Save fuel. And still making sure that I am uh, near the pace car. I don't even want to be shifting while uh, we got this long ready. Going green. stretch to the green. Car is off. Rev it up too much, keep it about 55. as much as we can because we can <laughs> that's why not be pretty gentle on it and feeling pretty good they are spinning back there But, looks like it was on the apron, so we are good, I think. So that feels pretty good. 
don't know how it would compare to other setups and such, but it seems to be okay to me. I make a habit of taking down here, like I said. It's free real estate. <laughs> There's no turning as well. It's interesting. Tires uh, might be coming into play a bit. I'm glad I have session last lap to compare to. Oh my god, I swear he just was about to dive in on us. That scared me. Okay, he was coming with a full head of steam and it was... frightened me. <laughs> Run off. Yeah. Can't cut down when someone's below you. Can't assume you know where they're gonna be. Not as much room there, but that's okay. Oh, all right, that's less okay. The next car's the lead up. Car inside. Keep high. Clear inside. You want to add your oil? The boat's looking pretty hot right now. Really cut me off last lap. Oh well, no harm done, I guess. We're holding on just fine on older tires. The hope is that we go long enough that they feel the need to come in, and I can come in with them. But I'll have another set of tires. This is a fun track, though. I've always been kind of uh, unsure how I feel about it, but I've really grown to enjoy it over time. It's very, very unique, and I like that. I even kind of like the dog leg that everybody hates. I think I would prefer it wasn't there if there were grass there, but I can appreciate it for what it is as well. So if he pits ahead of us, I will follow him. That's where I'm at right now. Alright. Wasn't long enough. It looks like... Like I said, I'm coming in when the other guys come in. Otherwise, uh, having an extra set of tires doesn't really do me any good. Or, you know, I don't really have an extra set of tires anymore is what I'm kind of trying to say. Saying 0.4 gallons we need to save, but you know, iRacing itself says 50, which would give us six laps extra. So it's kind of <laughs> seems like it's indecisive about whether we have enough. Or not. It's kind of unclear, but it's fine. Take the shortest way around, save some fuel, make sure we're good. Plus down here, track should be cooler. I don't think that's, I think the whole track should be pretty cool at this point, but doesn't hurt. 
guy that caused some trouble has left. <laughs> Thanks. Tyler Glass guy clearly does not Thanks like him. <laughs> Forgot the head. I had the muted. It was actually kind of nice, but I'll unmute it for now. In case they say anything. Oh, the five. Looks like they got into some trouble. I don't. I don't want to be back there. <laughs> I don't want to be back there, in the firing line. The road is closed. I think that's how you die. We're under caution. It's closed. Ooh, that was pretty close to leaving a closed pit. I would think. You had to have been cutting it close there. We should have just enough fuel to get us to the end. Not saying we have enough fuel. Like I said, not too concerned about it. We are over halfway through. Got some green running. Would be nice to have a little bit more, but I've been spoiled lately with... Uh, <laughs> I feel like I've had some good open races, and then, of course, 150 at Nashville Super Speedway recently for the ARCA League race. That was amazing. Yeah, that's what I thought happened to him. Didn't leave the pits in time. We'll be on the outside. Now. One to go. Next time, next time by. by. You're on the outside this time. Hey, your ass ain't looking so good. Have I been in the pits since uh, I ran into the back of the Home Depot guy? Remember. Get ready. Go if I have damage, it's not doing much of anything. Hide car is off. I'm going 55. He's going 55, I guess. Now he's going a little bit faster. Keeping an eye on him. I got a whip! Alright. About as good as I could have hoped for, I think. I hope to God you didn't get a black flag. No, I'm good. I was waiting on them to wreck. That still feels great. Oh yeah, that was me, my bad. Oh, yeah. It'd be great to, it'd be great to race on the tires, though. You go the whole way through the pit and go into turn one there, 14. We don't have a choice but two lifts, or else you're going to drive through us. So you're just, you know, you guys keep doing it. We're just giving it to you because we have to, because we don't want to wreck, you know? Yeah, taking a rewind, three wide, real fast off that restart like that, drop down to that pit road, just stick back, move, you know? That just puts everybody in danger. One. Again, I couldn't really understand you, but I'm just saying, like, I had to give so much to you just so I didn't destroy my race. You know what I'm saying, man? So you're not, you're not fast or nothing, you're just getting down there and, and you're screwing us with what you're doing. <laughs> They're mad. <laughs> yeah, if I didn't move and hit the car above me, you would have taken all three of us out. Hey, the two. Is he going to be on the lead lap again? And I almost slid up into you trying to break enough to give him room. It's just a, it's just me. It's rude to do that, dude. I get it, you get spots, but that's all because we're... Because we want to continue the race, or else we'd be, got, we'd be done. He angry. We're not pitting. I don't believe it. Need I remind everybody it is uh, two fifty two each and pretty much. There's no need for yelling. So I'll just take a deep breath and think and talk and carry over your stuff. I agree, Terry, I'm too intoxicated for that. Alright, that's enough of that. I'm sorry you had to hear that. Uh, I hope the bleeding out of your ears stops soon. I think mine might be terminal. 
But, uh, still no pitting. No one around us pitting. I'm really dying to green laps, so. Also, I still feel like we're holding on just fine. We're gonna be on the inside this time. That'll be easier to see on the restart, at least. You got loads of fuel. Loads of fuel. Don't have to worry about that anymore, really. Don't think we needed to worry in the first place. Definitely don't need to now. Sweet home Alabama. Hey, it's easier to walk down the hallway than down the street. He just said Rocky Tom because he's a Tennessee Bulls fan. Yeah, try to go to a game there once. Most annoying fucking shit ever. Well, the good, well, I mean, yeah, if it's an acquired taste. I mean, they, I think in the Alabama game, they played Rocky Top like 150 times. I'm pretty sure at some point in time, I'd get tired of it. Real teams play Tom Petty. Not sure what they're talking about. Music, I guess. Uh, only loser Florida fans. You'll be running out some machine with your eyes. Jeez, Harry. Much better to start on the Hello, inside here. Please. Since you're basically starting in a corner. Best team play shifting up the ball. Hey Terry, back it up. Come back. <laughs> Hopefully you get some green laps now. I mean hell, I've been backing up through this field all race long. Alright, I need focus. Trying to give him another chance. <laughs> no one's gone super early yet. We keep getting cautions. I might, we might see someone do it just to try to spread the field out. But I don't know if that'll, that'll probably just cause more cautions, honestly. Breaking that I was expecting, but we're good. Much prefer this higher line in this corner. Oh, come on. Uh. Alright, add to the chat to them. Unfortunately, Phoenix can be one of these kind of tracks. Not quite no, Martinsville, I'm but you can get a lot of crashing. It is a uh, single split, too. Yeah, this race is worse than my first marriage. I would have to agree. I, mean, I, 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 I would agree on that myself. They're not going on that. Life is a whore. Excuse my French. <laughs> Did she go to Tennessee? I can see this getting misogynistic quick, so I'm going to turn that off. <sighs> he was about to make the "she's the only ten I see" joke right there, so he didn't miss anything. We are in third place still with our old tires. Still haven't really used the tires in ages. So, I guess I'll talk about other things this week. I really love Phoenix. I've really grown to love Phoenix, kind of like I was saying before. Um, I'll be doing the trucks here as well, I hope. And I just finished the ARCA race on dirt. I think I mentioned that earlier. That was very fun. Just finished that before this race. Had a three-car battle for the win. Nobody ever ran into anybody, each other, not even once. No wall riding. It was, uh, the guys were being respectful, and it was just, it was an awesome race. Very fun. So difficult to drive, but that's, uh, that's a fun challenge to take on. And it's, like, not like a super speedway where you can never get a away from anybody, you know? It's, uh, you can hit your marks. It's, it's on the driver, you know? You gotta... 
got to have the skill. And uh, that makes it pretty fun. So that was pretty good. I might do um, one of these on my own time if uh, there's more participation, just so we actually get to do some grid laps. We'll see if I upload that or not. You leaning towards no, I wouldn't, but maybe if it's like a crazy high strength of field or there's someone we know in here or someone cool like a real life driver in the race, I will. We'll see. But I think uh, I will want, want to get a better experience in this, but we'll see if I have even the time to do that. I usually like to race everything I want to race once and then I'll start considering doing like doubles of things. Good. Okay. I do want it on just in case they're saying something's important. Like, uh, I'm going to go immediately to spread the field out. Like, you know, if they're going to say something like that. But they're quiet right now. Probably for the best. <laughs> I like the Three's car. I really love those colors. Looks very like Miami or something. One left to green. They should have cave in here put dirt on this track. I am all for that, as bad as I'm struggling here. Speaking of dirt on the, speaking of dirt, you can go do Arca on the dirt right now. It's kind of crazy. What's that? What's that? Uh, US, it's on USA. Go wall pop, you'll have a lot of fun. About to go green, stay focused. I was hoping for Volusia. <laughs> you'll I randomly blow in. engine. No, you won't. If you don't wall ride. Glad people wall riding are blowing engines. You get what you deserve. <laughs> we are going. Outside. Green laps, please? No, oh, I didn't get a black flag there. Oh, hey, Home Depot guy's back. Isn't he like way in the back? Laps down or something a minute ago? Good for him. Getting back up here. Y'all driving up a whole lot deep with my dumb ass dude. This side ahead. I just drive it as deep as the white guy, so it's not very deep. Speak for yourself, bud. Getting kind of checked up by the three there. You poor shelter dog. Wasn't trying to get on his ins inside. What is he doing in these corners, man? He's breaking at weird times. I almost got in the back of him. Get on his inside again, don't need to battle anymore. Gotta remember we're on uh, older tires. Inside. Not sure where the four is planning on going, but I uh I'm not moving out of the way for him. It's like he tried to push up into me. Just 
just not getting the rotation in this corner anymore on these older tires. Good, just gotta back up the corner a little bit more. It'll be fine. It'll be time to pit, I think. If we get another caution. Got on it a little too hard there. Got tight. Try to make up for it with a big dog leg cut. <laughs> Ripped it through the exit a little bit there. That behind has fresher tires, I think. He pit lap 60 something. The water temp is getting high. Uh oh. Alright, gotta keep an eye on that then. Now it's within the warning zone. We'll just uh, try to be off the throttle a little bit more. No, I'm done. You're good, man. I'm watching the temp. I'm about to blow this damn thing. There we go. Just be off the throttle. Let it roll into the corner a little bit more. We should be just fine. And see how much more turn he's getting in there. Or is really diving in, not sure where he plans on going again. Guess he got around me, that was really aggressive though. Yeah, we'll got damage from all these muppets, so you're faster. If one of us do that to each other, he trains, let us go. <laughs> one of us faster, one of us does damage. Yeah, well, alright. I'm just Seems gonna the, keep uh, the uh, tapes wh where it's at, even though it's a little bit concerning at the moment. Like if we get a caution and, and take the tape off, well, it's gonna be a short ish run anyway. Not a big deal. <laughs> one of these days, we might get a chance to have a green flag run for longer than like 30 laps. And if I end up in sixth, we don't get another caution. That's perfectly fine too. It's about first race, but 26 is trying to give us a caution. I'm being way off the pace down there. Dude, these black cars are horrible. Get out of the way, dude. I am out of your way. Quick sniveling. I think he did okay. Inside. Clear. I was just about to defend you, 26. <laughs> Car inside, clear. I don't think I caused any wreck, did I? I was out of the way then, right? Except for one car. Yeah, that was that one car. <laughs> <laughs> My bad. That's alright. What are you doing, brother? Trying to hold it on the bottom. I don't think we were ever catching those guys ahead anyway. We're going to need the uh, pit stop. We're going to need the caution come out. So. Not a big deal if we lose time to the guys ahead. I was going to defend him because I felt like he did okay. He was off the pace, but he was on the low line, and I think that's probably where you want to be. P6. It looked to me like he held his line down there. 
Bring that bottom to the And you can run basically all three lines in that corner. With the high line probably being the most preferred. So I think he did the best he could. And then he overdrove the final corner, almost into me. I'm just learning. I haven't even ran a practice lap for the trace. Things are getting high, but they are not getting up into the red or anything. So, it should be okay. It's, it's aggressive tape, and I made it 1% more aggressive, but I don't think it's concerning. I mean, okay, let me rephrase that. I don't think it's going to be an actual danger to blow. I think it's a little concerning, because <laughs> it's in the orange, but I think we should be fine. Yeah, I rode back to that, but I'd rather smoke the bigger X. Old timer. I ran so many laps. Right now we've got tire like, sets on the wall. The uh, looks like saving a set really didn't do us any yeah, good. Yeah, that's how it feels. I can't let you practice in that book. Hello, Apron. Here to make me drive slower, I see. We got the 22. He was sketchy earlier as a lap car, so. The best thing I ever did, though, is just kind of focus on having fun instead of caring about eye Got 20 in the wall. Yep, yep, I hear ya. Let's we get around these guys real easy. We're not. We're super off pace. Outside, you're on the bottom. Three wise. I'll take too much to go enter some like late model race at Oxford because, you know, I just hate Oxford. Got around him. Technically did it three wide, but it didn't feel too dangerous because we hit, we're so yeah, far away from him. We actually catching back up? How is that possible? We haven't gotten tires since lap 20. Anybody running pay to win setup? Maybe it's because they're just battling each other or something, or maybe I'm not even getting closer, it just feels like it. More like anybody want a chair set up. Yeah, that up. I'm on the free setup from old school racing forums, it's doing okay. I don't want to pay to win, it's just... It's just weird. I like paying for sets. The front just now, 1.7. Full course yellow caution. Yeah, Everybody else still has a set tire. Yeah, I misjudged where you were at. I tried to walk in and need his 18 to keep up with the field. Looks like he's doing okay. I don't think he did you there. It's open. I'm just trying to get through this. I got I got a shit up, shit setting. I'm all messed up. Yeah, I just completely misjudged it. I thought I was lower than what I was. Watch your speed. Watch your speed limit in the pits. You've got plenty of fuel. Kind of, it's such a weird pit entry there. If you don't take four here, you are making a massive mistake. I'm taking two, dude. I'm taking four. Pit box team, 10. JK. 5. I'm so three, sorry, 26. 2, 1. Right here. Yeah, no problem, man. Oh, we did have some optional repairs. 74.79, still not really that bad for how long we were out there. Although we did, of course, do a lot of caution laps. Go, go, go! I almost beat the four out, even though we were pretty far behind. How many people stayed out is the question. I got it. Right on. So we are now on equal tires. Feels good. No idea what place we're in. It's our open. 
I usually like it in uh, Pay to Win setup. It's fun. I mean, I like it. It's just, it's weird. Honestly, this setup's kind of weird, too. Like I said, it kind of feels like it's driving itself, but also that's kind of a good thing, maybe, so. <laughs> I don't know. Five laps to go. Twenty-six. We are in eighth, apparently. But I think we got some guys ahead that have not pit. So that's going to be curious. Thinking we got the top four, maybe didn't pit. So that's fun. Cool. Do you have a copy? Yeah, what's up? Um, can I get by for the game? Uh, just kidding. Wait, what'd you say? <laughs> I was just joking. I was like, can I uh, get by for the game? <laughs> I'm just joking. Uh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. This could be, be sketchy with uh, guys on older tires. You might be going by me anyway. You finishing there, it's showing uh, negative 21 for you. Me here is negative 9. <laughs> Top 4 are on old tires. Yeah. Yeah. I'm in danger. Mm hmm. We all are. Got Garfield back up here. Yeah, I am. We could be uh, very well seeing some green white checkers here in a moment. Hope we are uh, alive to see it. Sixteen's not going, I guess. Oh my god, he's going so slow. Ripple up so bad. We just have to be patient or we're gonna die. Made it around. Good Good position. Okay. Round the outside. <laughs> Are we actually going to get the white flag? No. They want you in single file. Hey, come on, guy. Right now. The race has been extended, <sighs> so we can have a green, white, that was so interesting. So close. Love the pod. Good for us, though. I think with some more time, we might be able to get some more spots. If I go to bed now, I'm going to pray to Ty Gibbs. <laughs> Ty Gibbs, also known as Jesus. If you don't know, he compared himself to Jesus in an interview recently, which was very funny. But it wasn't supposed to be funny. I mean, I'm intoxicated and I still can't understand the genius. Well, when y'all go back and watch it, you're going to see right there a couple in a row of just attempting to try to make a caution. Uh, and then it's front foyer into the wall and then took me with them. Fortunately we're on the outside again. Really would have loved to be on the inside. I mean I'll take all three green white checkers if I can avoid the uh wreck. That's okay. The three is on very old tires still. Lot thirty nine last time he pit. Of course he's gonna be right in front of us. Go figure. Really just bad positioning we're we're kind of being stuck with here. How about the separation? And slower guys and such. So he's just not going to let the lucky dog by, I guess. I'm going to start swerving when he's right there. Pay attention. Yeah, I think I'm dedicated just to follow Colton. Unless I got to run, I think I'm going to follow him to the finish. 
<laughs> Nashville and Michigan were the greatest races of my life. <laughs> that was like eight months ago. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Pit Road is closed right now. Can you come to think about it? Yeah, Michigan was fun. For the last, yeah, I don't know, week on week seems to be getting worse. This track is great if you get a long run, but it's fun. I mean, it's different. Well, you would have been green to the end if the 18 didn't try to wreck the 22, uh, half a lap prior, when he couldn't do it going into one. Coming off the two, he just yanked it to the right. Uh, or to the left and hit the wall, spun, bounced back on the track, and then gunned it in the center and took me with it. <laughs> like, just to bring out a caution. They were like 30 feet away from the white flag, too. Yeah, I mean, he was literally trying every which way possible to bring a caution. I mean, he shipped it to one, shipped it off, off back, but like, tried to take the 22 with him as an end of the bystander and then just wipe the field back behind him because the you know, whatever. I mean, hell, you were 13 to sit there. You sit 13, that's a damn good thing. Hey, 16, do you like Big Red? What? Me? <laughs> what is happening in this race? 16. What would Ross Chastain do? Oh, God. We better not see Ross Chastain uh, move around this. I got a Jackpot 9000. I was thinking about what Ross Chastain would do on the last lap here. He did it for millions. You're going to ruin everybody's day. Why is the five on the outside? Let's oh, know. I'm sorry, I've locked up trying to miss like we'll have a miss you. No! When this caution is over, caution, yellow flag, line up, single file. I, I was closed. on the brink! I'm sorry, 24. Stop damn it. Pit Road is now open. Hey, 14. What, what was up with that, man? Did you not see the, them spinning, or did you do that on the car? I don't know what happened, but I guess we're okay. See what it happened was. <laughs> Jesus, now up to eight X. You, man, you guys are just straight. Well, that'll be a four X. In front of us, man. Yeah, you'd have, you'd have no clue. I hit that left rear. It just went for a little oh, oh, touch of foot. Please don't ever drive the corners for just two laps so we get this over with, please. <laughs> You're probably better, you have better luck teaching a fish to climb the tree than... Honestly, I think I'm okay. Comment. I'm in fifth place now, so I get to be the inside car. Goes in one ear and out the other for most people. I agree with, uh... Got the lucky dog. Let them pass on the outside. Considering the circumstances, I think that turned out about as well as it could have for me. We actually didn't lose any spots, we just flipped off. Yeah, I just wore the right rear out a little bit. That's going to give me a little extra turn. Thanks. <laughs> Lucky dog, coming high. <laughs> Looking at the positives here. Left us 13. Car bike. Full course yellow. Pits are open. When life gives you lemons, make an omelet, right? I need a quick couch on now. So we are getting well into our green white checkers. We're under caution, pits are closed. 
We'll see how the car liked that power slide. Oh, hey, a car. Surprise cameo by the cone. Hey, we will gain one I rating if we finish here in the top five. <laughs> but a long open race that shouldn't hurt us at all also in 4.9 so yeah, I don't really yeah. care <laughs> anyway yeah like I said it just felt that way I mean yeah, so we will get it done this time kind of did like being able to take it around the outside on this uh, upcoming next corner right here Turn, hold on, let me read. Turn one, apparently. I guess the dog leg does not count as a turn, or is the dog leg the start finish line, I guess? I listen. <laughs> I don't I don't know what the deal is with this track, but About to go green. that's okay. Go. We'll be okay. We just gotta make it two more laps. Be my checkered. Maybe more if we crash again. Let's hopefully get it done now pushed my luck enough already with this race. We made it to the white flag! Shifting? You crazy? Yeah, I am. That was not even, that didn't do much, I don't think. <laughs> but oh well. Shifting again? What are you crazy? That kinda worked. Oh well. Before. I'll take it. Good job. Very good job. Good race, good win. Some fun uh some fun times up front. What the hell did I just see in my rearview mirror? Something's happening back there apparently. I was gonna say the same thing if that's what you saw. Sorry. The time the timer was out real good. Alright. That guy I was gonna give me a tap, I guess. these fucking dumbasses behind me. <sighs> Let me get with four to Six nine seven on those old tires. Seems like we're okay. I definitely did not. I wasn't mad at me about anything at all. I don't think I did anything. Fucking <laughs> stupid. He's what coming for me. <laughs> oh well. We'll get right to it. It's already been a long enough race with a couple green white checkers. So P4 after starting fourth. I think I could have gotten better, but you know, kind of just got in a weird situation there. Lost my track position a little bit, but uh, not a slam dunk. I'll just you know I'll take a top five for sure. Congrats to the six. Well earned win. Like I said, let's uh, get to this sense. It's already been long enough. The incidents. Forthcoming. Loud. So there is the 27. He was the uh, highest car number in here. He just needs to practice some more. Looked like he didn't quite know. No, I, I didn't even know Justin. It's all good, man. Yeah, know how to get through that corner. I just wasn't seen everywhere else, which probably overshadowed that, but I can't even remember what that, that was, what you're talking about. 
Uh, I just found it, lap 60. Dear God, I don't know exactly what lap was. It was more in the beginning of the race, probably in the, lap, in the first 30 laps there. I just kind of got tight going into the uh, third corner, I guess it would be, and uh, fuck, 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 that dude, you kind of tapped me in the back. You guys chatting it out. I'm going to go ahead and mute that. They're having their own essentially private conversation about things, so we'll be able to talk about the incidents. Just got some wall hits and small things early on after the guy spun. We're going to get a caution again here soon, though. We'll see what that was all about. Tony has found the wall a couple times now. Finding both walls on the straightaway. Though, to be fair, it was on exit the one before, so that's understandable. What's the five up to? Just a tiny bit on the injury. Where did the guy that said he was going to... 24... Kind of going real slow through the corner, 13, comes up and finds him. 13 wasn't really holding a line very well down below, though. Just, uh, you'll get this always with these single split races. There's always going to be people that are just going through the corners, so much different speeds. It's always going to happen. There it is right there. I think the 9 majorly underdrove it. Five probably could have avoided hitting him. He got seventh. He was a. Uh, he was saying he wanted to follow me. But it looks like he at least made it to the end. Six blocking, driving line down there, hitting the wall, coming up, running into the eleven. Yeah, he looks like he's been causing some problems. This guy that almost got us too. He's trying his best. I don't want to be mean to him, but could be uh, doing better. I would have had a few less cautions. Two, three. That's a fake wall. Oh man, where's the 15 going? Just completely overdrove that corner. You have to get on the brakes pretty hard, so it's easy to do. You really have to slow down for that corner. Yeah. See, Matt, was the seven mad at me for running into the back of here? I really tried not to. You, you know what I mean. Getting the wall slowing down real fast. He had the benefit of the wall slowing him down. I only had my brakes. I tried. I didn't want to slam it too hard and spin out or something. I think we were okay. I gave him a boop, but I don't think it should have done much. It didn't do much in my car, 8.5 optional, and it never really even felt different, so. In fact, that might have been the only reason our temperatures were getting kind of weird. Might have had a little bit of a crinkle on the front of the car, might have been making the temperature a little bit sketchier. Two in the wall. Well, finding a little bit of wall. KFC cart, you're taking the dog leg. Ugh. Here's another uh, issue caused by the 19 right there, it looks like. Super off pace, and the guys are catching him 25 miles an hour faster because he's just completely off pace. And so the 21 has to check up for him, the 13 has to check up for the 21, you get an accordion effect. 21's trying to give him a ton of room, the 13's coming up too fast. It's just, it's hard to even blame these two guys, it's just a moving chicane over here. Like, you gotta, it's important to at least be somewhat up to speed or else you're just gonna cause wrecks. It's like the same reason you can't go 20 on the highway. 22, nowhere near the wall, and he has to be near the wall, and that's what kills the 12, it looks like. Tries to save it, but no can do. Bop. Hey, what? I don't...
What is the 19 doing? Is he just here to wreck? Like, I don't know how to explain that. Like, we're in a caution right now. He's like brake checking the 8 and takes himself out. You can see by watching his speed, like he's brake checking him when they're trying to catch the field. I don't... <laughs> like, what is this guy doing? Maybe the 8 did it on purpose, but... Why is the 19 pulling right in front of him anyway? Like, I don't... <laughs> I'm so confused by the interaction. Maybe they had history that I don't know about, but that's just strange. No worries. So, I don't know why we're seeing this. Some damage, I guess, maybe. 18 is self-spinning. Does everybody avoid him? Oh, how about that? So many people coming and everyone avoids him. Nice job, everybody. Nine's on his phone or something, running into the wall on the caution. I don't know why we're seeing that. Here's where we're on old tires. Ooh, the three runs into the back of the six, give him a nice boost through the corner. Three trying to turn down into the 18. Lots of confusion there. Before taking the high line in the final corner. Yeah, the 19 is... I don't know what he's doing. He finds the invisible wall. That looks like substance abuse. I hope that doesn't cause a caution. Does this cause a caution? We'll watch the cactus. Cactus turns yellow under caution. It's a pretty cool cactus. There he is. That is something special. All right. <laughs> Moving on. He has uh, departed the race. When he's drifting on straight away. Oh, can't hold it together. Wait, he does. That was a creative way to make his way through the through the lap. But he did it. Oh, with an eight self spins. That sounded weird though. Well, that was intentional. You can just hear it. Although, why would he do that intentionally and hit the wall? What are guys doing here? Like, you could hear him just smack the throttle. Like, when you're that sideways, there's no logical reason I can think of other than trying to spin. It's not taking it seriously, I guess, and bringing out a caution? Like, why would you do that, man? Trying to have fun here. We have enough cautions already. I wish I didn't have to race late nights all the time. Three wide. Oh my gosh. Got a huge, just a big stack up effect. That guy's going real slow. He was on old tires at this point, I think. He comes up and hits the 10 because they're 3 wide and he's way off pace. 15 has to check up. 10 sliding through the corner. Does he get caught on the wall? No, he just... has to gather it up. I thought he got stuck in the wall or something for a second. Well, he gets going again. Homer Simpson just gonna plow into the 23 million miles an hour. Because why not? And we've got ourselves another caution. Wow. Thought for a second the 13 was going to run in the back of the 5. Don't know why we saw that. 18. Very different pace. Through the corner. 
more single split shenanigans here. I think it's the two, you just gotta not be right behind them and expect them to be at a different pace. You just gotta be real careful around people. Easier said than done though, sometimes. Ooh, 14 hard into the wall on the inside. He's got more to show us too. He's gonna show us plowing into the back of the 16. Not sure it was a great move to stay out there for him. He's just putting himself in front of faster guys and on older tires. That's just such a dangerous spot to be in. Maybe he ran out of tires and didn't have a choice. I don't know. Move right along past some of these wall hits. Getting up near the end of this thing, though, lap 86, that's just a, well, <laughs> it was just a blink, and then it became a wall hit. There's a hit on the straightaway. is going to turn all the way down into the right rear of the 20. I think these guys were, I heard they wrecked each other or something, it looked like it was on purpose. They're just all over the place, both of them. I think they're trying their best, but struggling. KFC into the wall. What are you doing here? So the 8 looked like he purposely caused a caution earlier. Uh, I, I don't know. I don't know what the 26 is doing. The 26 is so far off pace. He's just driving in the middle of the track going super slow. The 8 should have easily been able to go around him. So I don't know why he ran into the back of him. He had like all this room down here, but also the 26 is majorly off pace. Like, what a... This race is weird, man. I don't know what anyone's doing. So that brings us to our uh, caution that allowed us to catch up. 14's wrecking under caution. It's loose there, trying to catch up with the field, I think. Unless, did this happen separately to everything else? I don't know. No, that's under caution. That's embarrassing. And then they're gonna run over the 22. 22 off pace, majorly. It's something happened behind him, too. I saw a car do something weird. The 8's having some trouble. I... Has the 8 been drinking? Has he been on the duff? He just like stops turning right there. And you would think, you would expect better from a 2.3k I rating guy. I don't know. <laughs> 22 breaking way early for the corner and the 18's not expecting it. I guess maybe not. It's I, it's so hard to tell what's going on. There's so many different things happening. So the 22 breaks hard, way too hard, into this corner, and then breaks into the path of the 18. And the 18's coming in really hard, and they just find each other. He saves it, though. But then the 22 tri goes up and tries to hit him because he's really upset that he went straight in front of a guy in the braking zone. Hitting the brakes way too hard, so he intentionally tries to wreck him and misses. So that's classy. What was that? We got more wrecking happening up front. I wish this race split. I really do. Eight. Spinning again out of that corner. Eighteen spinning by himself. These guys just can't get around the course by themselves. They're all just wrecking on their own. Mm. Get some guys right there, too. Spin cycle for the 20. We keep seeing the pink car under caution. For some reason. And here's the two. Completely missed the corner. So we have to drift it. 
So what what's happening there? I think maybe he's trying to go around the other guy and just lost track of where I was. I don't know. Hmm. <laughs> Drives it pretty hard. He just doesn't get it turned at all. I don't know if like he got in the brakes really hard and it just didn't turn for him or what. He got me good though. I think I gave him plenty of room, he just didn't turn. I gave him a lot of room. Like he's got all, like obviously you don't want to be down here, but he's got all kinds of room and he's just coming all the way up. He should be down here. So even the 5k, I <laughs> rating guys are struggling. But we save it, and then I guess I was sideways enough to cause a caution here. Hey, you know it's a good save if you're sideways enough to cause a caution, but you save it. <laughs> like I said, it didn't really do as much trouble, because I got it going. And, uh... <laughs> burn out those right, that right rear. This one is just going to run into someone when the caution's out. More things are just really hard to explain. Caution's already out at this point. Should be, I think. Actually, maybe it's not. You know, <laughs> the pace car's not even back. So I guess caution's not out yet. Oh. Because this is a later restart, duh. Wait, no it's not. Why is it the time getting all weird? So we just saw this, and then it's like we went back in time. I don't know. I'm, lo I'm losing my mind. But did something simultaneously happen back here? Yeah, I guess it did. Guys running into each other. But the caution is out. And then the 20 comes and gets the 24. Okay, now we got it all straight. <laughs> he just runs in a... Th what, what are you doing? <laughs> Why would you do that? <laughs> sir? Excuse me, sir. Why would you do that to the 24? He's not paying attention? I don't know. See that guy under caution for no reason again. And just a little bit of wall on the entry to the final corner there. Heading to the checkered flag, I think. Yeah, there it is. So, that's how we ended up with a P4. Guys are just being really stupid. 20 intentionally wrecks the 24. I think he already did that. I thought he already did that earlier, but I guess he's just really got to make his point with virtual race cars. I don't know. Don't do this, guys. Like, never do this, even if the race is over. First of all, the race might not be technically fully over yet because... Everybody might not have finished, but you got people with direct dri drive wheels as well, where they got like really serious force feedback. Like that can hurt someone. Like imagine someone resting their arm, like in their wheel or something. <coughs> Excuse me. And you, they don't expect it to come, and then you slam them like this, and you know their wheel jerks really hard. Like you could actually hurt somebody doing that. Like just don't do it. It's not necessary. Like, uh, go take that to NASCAR heat or whatever. But enough of me griping about nonsense. <laughs> St guys still running into each other. I don't know what's going on. Celebrating a P3. Lots of weirdness going on, but... Well, that'll do it. We got P4. We got a 4X from the two car running into us, but that was no big deal. We actually kept it straight enough to keep our positions, and uh, is what it is. I'm actually going to start, I'm going to rewatch a little bit of my, uh, the final bit of the race here for me. So I feel like we made some uh, fun moves. We'll start watching from lap 100, I guess. And uh, while this is going on, I guess I'll do the outro, I guess you could call it, and say thank you for watching. And I hope you enjoyed. And uh, I will see you next time. I'll let you go. And uh, if you'd like, watch the uh, final kind of laps here with me. I don't know. This is a weird outro. <laughs> Went around the outside there.
Map 104, yeah, that's where we got wrecked. Okay. Then coming to the green here. This was our final green-white checkered. Pat is running around. Standing next to me. What do you want? Hello? Hi. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear that on the mic. Would you like to say goodbye? Okay. <laughs> Jasper says goodbye. But we got the inside here, so we're able to cut down. I don't know. It felt more intense in the car. It doesn't look that spectacular <laughs> from out here. But we get our P4. And it was a pretty fun race when we had the green laps. Like I said, whenever we uh, actually were racing. The guys up front. It was kind of fun, so. Alright, real, <laughs> real outro. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.